Hey guys and welcome to another Dragon Village collection video. In today's video we'll be taking a look at the update that's coming tomorrow the 13th of June. But after it takes approximately 3 hours but it can change. So we get a new dragon form which is through an event which is the blue shark form of the shark dragon. Um, it looks amazing by the way. Also the new brilliant moonlight gem item has been added. It's already currently in the game as you can see with the um the attendance so this item allows you to change your dragon's personality to one of the personalities that have manifested in your account at least once do know this is limited because you can't use event personalities you can't use card code exclusive personalities and personalities that can be given by dragons which is lunate chaotic and Ar arcane and arcane being the secretive personality those can't be given so do remember that these are all the ones that can be given so with this update also comes the temple estella persian for pity system each time you use the temple estella entry ticket you will increase it by one point so if you watch the ads um, or have the sub that's twice a day so you get two points a day so you get the guaranteed um, after 50 points. So reach 50 and you get it. Then you can choose and obtain your favorite Persian form from the dragons that only appear in Temple Estella. And you can only obtain the Persian form if its guardian dragon is adult. So you can choose any Persian form. So that is very, very nice. Also, after the update system, Pity system... Points will be provided based on the number of times you've entered Temple Astala. So if you do that every single day, you should have um, at least one. I have no clue how to, how to calculate all of that. So we also get a new event, which is the Energic Sports Day, which is a short dragon board game event. They have noticed in the update prior to this that they will change the events. Um, I have the event notice that we will get into a bit later. So we have new items, so uh, bundles. Uh, the Brilliant Moonlight Jam is 300 diamonds and no limit. Gender Transition Ticket, 3 diamonds and only once a month. And the price of special shop item Moonlight Jam will be lowered by 100 gems. So one of the improvements will be the Gender Transition Ticket. Gender transition ticket function will be updated to allow changing the target genders, uh, target dragon genders, excuse me. However, the gender transition ticket cannot be used for collab dragons, adventure dragons, and adventure dragons are Puppeteer and Kunak, uh, Malice dragon, Monthly dragon, uh, Pay dragons, and dragon that have no opposite gender, which I think is very fair, otherwise, there's no use of any of these. Uh, so the Temple Estella sweep function will also be added. Um, they will be available when you, uh, when you complete registration of Baryon, which is the second dragon. Uh, when you select a dragon by touching the sweep button, you can obtain um, the sweep rewards. The type of dragon you can obtain may be changed depending on the dragon you take, which is normal as of now as well. So instead of you having to go through it, you can just sweep. So dragons obtained location will be indicated in till and quest. So the automatic production management system will be updated, will be added, excuse me, in the village town. It's too much text, I'm sorry. Uh, so production management menu has been added in town and it will allow easy production management in town. Fill in one go function will allow immediate production of the most recent produced product, which I'm so, so happy about. Because that was the problem I had with it. They all claimed it at once. Um, also some main quest requirements will be lowered. Pause the screen if you want to read these. So now onto the event. Obviously when the event is in I will make a more in-depth count as usual. So this is how the event looks like. As you can see prayer essence. Remedies, pills, brooders. Uh, shelter ticket, dealer's box. No clue what these is, but this looks like village items, egg points, um, cosmic crystals, I believe they're called. I, I change the name every single time. I apologize for that. 
So obtain dice through event missions. You can move around the board with the obtained dice. So throw the dice depending on how much you throw, you move. Uh, you can obtain additional cumulative rewards through batons, which are the ones on the corners. And that can be obtained by completing the board or reaching the certain areas. Um, so by the looks of it, reach a certain um, batons, if I pronounce that correctly, and you get the rewards. Um, you can obtain patient moonpees every three times you complete the board. So that solves the problem of the personalities, which I'm very, very happy about. Also, they do note guest accounts cannot participate in this event. So do note that. So that was the patient moon piece, which is this one, the purplish, which is the left one that you can see here. So the in-game rewards are, like I said, pills, brooders, cosmic crystals, prayer essence and egg points. We have event village objects, which I was right about. We have uh, the patient moon piece. We also have the energetic moon piece, which is the right one. So our dark and more bright ones. We have the blue shark form of the shark dragon. We have event titles and event user frames. So the criteria for obtaining user frames and titles for cumulative rewards are based on existing event participation data. So maybe as... Um, the previous event as in rankings, but I'm not sure we'll go. We'll see that tomorrow when the event is in and I will let you guys know. So I'm really, really um, excited about the new events. Sorry, I'm still a little bit sick as of recording. Um, I'm very happy with the new forms. I like new forms. And uh, that you're almost guaranteed basically to get the Asia Moon piece, obviously, depending how much you play. Which I'm very happy about too. So yeah. If you enjoyed this video. Give it a thumbs up. And subscribe to my channel. If you're new. Hit the notification button. To be notified. Whenever a new video goes live. In the description down below. A link to download the game. As well as a link to the official Dragon Village Collection Discord server. And a link to my own Discord server. If you like to join. Also I do want to note. As you can hear by my microphone. I have a new mic. I've done some testing. Um, obviously I still need to do more testing. But I want to give this video out for you guys as soon as possible so i'll see you guys as usual in the next one bye bye